Okay, so I thought I'd do a quick video here on a new purchase. Uh, I uh, finally broke down and ordered an oscilloscope. I haven't used an oscilloscope in, uh, in quite a while. So I thought I'd do a quick unboxing. We'll take this thing out of the box, plug it in, and uh, try to calibrate the probes. And we'll see how long that takes. So I'll just time this on my stopwatch as we go through the process. So let's get started. Looks like uh, pretty simple packaging here. We've got uh, the probes. Power cord. Uh, no, actually that's the USB cord to connect it to your PC if you so choose. I really did not want to buy a Chinese made product, but um, this model, which is the DS1202Z-E, um, was normally $379. I got this on sale for $299 with an extended five year warranty. Uh, you compare that to several thousand dollars for Tektronix scopes um, that were probably made in the same factory in some cases. Um, went ahead and broke down and went with the Regal. All right, so let's pull this puppy out. So uh, pretty small, compact unit. So basically, this is what we've got, a DS1202Z-E oscilloscope, and um, not a lot of complicated connections to make here. So we'll go ahead and plug the power cable in. Plug this in right here. And let's get a probe out. Also got our little um, calibration tool here, which I guess we will need in just a second. All right, so we'll start with this probe here. Plug it into channel one, push in and lock. So let's give it a try. So our stopwatch was about 5.08 when I pushed the power button. And we are powered up. Took about 20, 24 seconds to power up. So uh, let's see if we can calibrate this probe here. Looks like that is the ground. This is an internal one kilohertz signal. And let's see, mode is on auto. There we go, hit the auto button here. And looks like we've now got our, we've got our one kilohertz signal. You can see the scope definitely needs to be calibrated here. So we will take this and tweak the capacitance here till we get a nice square wave. And it looks like looks like that is about perfect or as close as we're going to get. So let's try the other probe. I'm sure these probes aren't the highest quality for the price. And same thing. Do a little calibration here.
and there we go. So really in less than nine minutes, and I've been talking a lot and fumbling a lot, um, definitely in less than 10 minutes, you can get this thing out of the box, powered up, probes calibrated and ready to go. So uh, nice addition to my workbench. So thanks for watching, and we'll be back um, again soon with some more videos. Thanks.